Welcome back to TMZ Sports. Mike and Renee here, and let's run and gun Renee. I, I love these topics today because Chris Paul's dad is hooping, and I, he, what? He doesn't. His his hops just are not there anymore. I I don't mean to laugh at this man. Uh, he he is awesome. He probably beat me in basketball. But Charles Paul and his future Hall of Fame guard son Chris Paul took to the basketball court, and I don't know how else to describe this for today. Let's just watch Chris Paul's dad uh, try and dunk the ball on a hoop that is not ten feet tall, by the way. Let's take a look. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> what you Yo, think, I love everything about that. I love everything about it. His dad is hooping, and you know what? I like that he might have missed the first one, but he came back and got the second one. I love watching like athletes play against their parents, so that's like one of my jam. Do you think they lowered the hoop from the first one to the second one, Renee? That's what I was trying to figure out. <laughs> nah, it was the same height. No, nah, I'm not even gonna do that to him. Definitely the same height. I think his foot just got stuck on the ground. He got tripped up a little bit. I'm sure uh, Charles Paul was a fabulous athlete and, and, and definitely in his younger days. So shout out to the Paul family. Um, let's move on to a guy that, shoot, I hope can rush the passer. Aziz Ajilari from New York Giants, second round pick, uh, top of the second round pick, got one of the absolutely coolest chains that you will ever see. Uh, let's take a look at this, Renee. This is from our guy, Leo Frost, who's a big-time jeweler. Made a lot of uh, a lot of chains and stuff for a lot of uh, top athletes. Is that Black there. Panther? D not only is it Black Panther, Renee, but it is a glow-in-the-dark Black Panther chain. Uh, this oh, thing is wow. aw it's awesome. So it has it has 50 carats of white and black VS1 diamonds, so, so high-quality diamonds there. It has 220 grams of 18 karat white gold. And again, if you look at this thing, and there you see it, in the dark, it actually glows. Such a cool piece of jewelry. I love this. That jewelry is A1, and I don't know what the price point is, but whatever it is, I feel like that one would be worth it. Wakanda oh, yeah. forever, all the way. I love it, though, because sometimes pieces, like you can see where they wanted to go with it, but it wasn't executed properly. That one, it's like you can see the vision. It glows in the dark. It looks dope yep. like A1. Shout out to uh, to Leo Frost for that. He nailed that one. And lastly, this is the most heartwarming story. It's early in the week. I think it's the most heartwarming story that you will see all week, though. So there was an 11-year-old Bills fan. Loves the Buffalo Bills. Unfortunately, this young man was diagnosed with Hodgkin's lymphoma and has been battling the cancer so courageously, and he beat this thing, Renee. And, you know, not just kids, uh, adults too, when you beat cancer, you will ring the bell on the way out of the hospital. Well, Buffalo Bills fans, that's not how they do it. They jump through tables. We've seen the Bills fans do that, and that's exactly what little Joshy Hutchinson did. Uh, instead of ringing the bell, watch what he does here, Renee. I love that. I thought that was such a sweet moment. And uh, I think the Buffalo Bills fans got to be proud when they watch the way he walked out of the hospital. Uh, oh, for sure. And I know the Buffalo Bills have like a crazy fan base. Yeah. And I hope that this continues to get the fan base like more engaged to have stories like that, because that's that full circle moment for sports being bigger than like football being bigger than sports. That's one of the moments right there. Renee, have you ever seen Connor? I, I don't know if we have this, but our producer, Connor, have you ever seen him jump through a table? I have not, but I can Watch, believe it. Look. I was like, oh my God. Oh, Crazy. Lord. So, Josh. So, that's the Buffalo Bills. Okay, I get it now. Yeah, that's so. what they do. This, They are crazy. Look at that. And <laughs> so, Josh, you're only 11 now, so I like the smaller table and you had the helmet on. That's what you have to look forward to uh, <laughs> in your wow. future as a Buffalo Bills fan, Josh. <laughs> <laughs>